I really love walking along trails and enjoying nature. It's a great change from the fast-paced lifestyle that we all have today. I'm Petra Barnfield and welcome to another Travel eCarts. Today we are going to visit an island where you can really get away from the concrete cities to the relaxing atmosphere of Cayman Brac in the Caribbean. Cayman Brac is the second largest island of the Cayman Islands. Only 19 kilometers long and 2 kilometers wide, it offers many enjoyable indoor and outdoor activities for the family. For an enjoyable laid-back getaway on Cayman Brac, it is only a 30-minute flight from Grand Cayman. Do the sights and smells of flowers relax you? If they do, you'll enjoy a visit to the beautiful Christopher Columbus Gardens. Built to celebrate the 500-year anniversary of the Cayman Islands, the Christopher Columbus Gardens are located on top of the bluff. Easily accessible by road, the gardens feature many different types of flora and fauna as far as the eye can see. There is a wall of 500 names to recognize those people who have made a significant contribution to the community of Cayman Brac. Overlooking the gardens is Christopher Columbus himself. Despite being a small island, Cayman Brac has had some larger-than-life visitors. Some of those visitors have been the many pirates of the Caribbean who used the caves on Cayman Brac to hide their treasures. Hundreds of years ago, pirates such as Blackbeard and Morgan used the many caves to hide their treasures and trinkets. Later, the caves were used to hide from hurricanes that passed over the island. In 1932, most of the residents of Cayman Brac used Peter's Cave to wait out a severe hurricane. Another cave used for hurricane shelter is Rebecca's Cave. While visiting these caves, you're encouraged not to disrupt the wildlife, and it's unlikely there is any pirate's treasure left. Have you ever wondered if the lost city of Atlantis really exists, and where it may be located? Well, we'll let historians sort that out, but in the meantime, we'll visit a replica of Atlantis being built in Cayman Brac. These figurines will be placed underwater as part of a creation by local artist Foots, with the encouragement of the Cayman Islands government. Cayman Brac's Atlantis will certainly be enjoyed by divers and snorkelers for years to come. If you are a fan of diving and snorkeling, Cayman Brac offers many opportunities to dive around the island. There are many boat tours that will take you to excellent diving locations where you can enjoy the relaxing underwater sights around Cayman Brac. Like many islands, Cayman Brac has its share of urban legends. One intriguing and mysterious story is one of a creature that roamed the island years ago. Some descriptions have it being a bear that washed up on shore from a ship. Others have described it as more human-like, standing on two feet and very hairy. It sounds a lot like Bigfoot from British Columbia, Canada. There are many other things to do and places to visit on Cayman Brac. I'm sure you will enjoy the Heritage House and the museum. If you prefer to be outdoors, there are many trails to explore and cliffs to climb. After a week on Cayman Brac, you may never want to leave. I'm Petra Barnfield, and this has been Travel eCards.